This channel is supported by my online fishing courses, and you can learn more and get significant discounts at saltstrong.com slash Skinner. I'll have links to all of the gear in the video description, and if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. All right, heading out for some ocean fluking on uh, Rick's big metal boat, and we've got Jack and Cliff, and we have somebody new on the boat, uh, Joe McCarry, and hey, we're going to have a good time out here today. Okay, just our second drift, and uh, Jack's going to get it started up in the bow. Now, one of the challenges on this trip is going to be the drift. Uh, we rarely had uh, a good, steady, natural drift uh, of a reasonable speed. Um, sometimes uh, the, the current, even though we're going in one direction, the current is running under the boat. But hey, we're, we're going to get off to a decent start here. That's good. We're getting up the bow. Yeah, this is a fluke. Uh, this one, yeah, I, I uh, might need a net on this one. All right. I think he's gonna be making it. Yeah. Yeah, you might have heard Rick say we're next to John's spot. Yeah, um, thanks to uh, John Halkius just fishing Long Island charters. Um, he, uh, he was out a couple days prior and uh, gave us some numbers. And, uh, they're working. Nice. All right, that's All definitely right. in. Okay. Wow, we did, hit, we, did we just hit four keepers? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, in like no time? Isn't texting us, telling us where to go. He, he, uh, oh, no, we'll have none of that anymore. Just dip, dip. He did uh, text us already. Is the net out on that? That's probably bottom. No, it's a fish. That's the nice fish. That's a netter, right? Yeah, definitely, yeah. I got it. Good. I got it. It's yeah. just the way the line's been going under the boat. I wasn't too sure. Okay, everybody on the boat is using uh, the John Skinner fluke rod that just came out this spring. Uh, there's a link to it in the video description. And uh, yeah, uh, it, boy, it took me a long time to get the rod right. Um, I spent like an entire season going through prototypes, but it's, it's perfect. It's <laughs> and uh, it's gonna do really well for us uh, this trip. This is a good one. Rick, watch your line. He's coming yeah, over by you. Over eh. Eh. It's all right. All right. Good enough. I'll take it. That's gonna make the. That's gonna make the mark. Thank you. Well, I'm gonna hook it for you. I know you do. <laughs> Come on back, come on back. He is, he is, there he is. Oh, all right. Yeah. Now we got the... Yes. We got a double netter over here? Definitely a netter. Okay. Good one. Look at those shakes. Uh, you know what, that's why I, sw I cursed. Do you feel like you have me maybe or something? Oh, no, this is a good fish. Good fish coming up. And, oh boy. Who's don't but don't sh don't just shake it. All right, move back. We're gonna need another pair of hands on that. Just unwrap that jig. Yep. Other way, other way, other way, other way. <sighs> on top there. Okay. All right. Look, watch, up, look watch, at the fish. Look, look at the fish. Yeah, got it. Oh, that's Cliffy's fish. All right. We're gonna just we're just gonna reel Go through this rig. Forget yeah, the rig. No, forget the that. no. Forget no, the rig. I don't know why we bring Rick. Oh, okay. it's his boat. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so nice one. 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 
Yeah, the drift is real messed up. You know, we're we're not covering much bottom here. We're catching fish, uh, but we're going to have to deal with the drift in a minute because you know we've been drifting at like 0.3 to 0.5, which is slow, but it's going to go down to literally 0.0 to 0 0.2. Um, we're going to have to uh, do something about that. And the line's going like every which way, definitely contributing to uh, tangles. We are moving though, 0 0.4, 0 0.3. Uh, I see all different kinds of numbers. As long as we're moving towards those. Spot? Yeah. But the drift is going to put us where we're supposed to be eventually. Well, I mean, he's hooked up. He, I mean, he caught, he caught. If, as long as we're going this way, we should be good, right? Yeah, I hope so. We're going that way. But where? Like, Are we really? On the, on the well, Rick, if you need to adjust, no. then... Let's put in the trawler. Oh. Ah, you Yeah, you know, you hang around this guy yeah, and... Exactly. I haven't had much body mouth today at all. Uh, I don't know about that. a fluke, a nice fluke. Go ahead, Cliff. When, I was waiting for you to come net it for Are me. Are we uh, netting it? Yes, yes it's a netter, yeah. Okay, I know. It's a big ass fish. Not a big ass fish. I mean, it's, a, it's probably a probably keeper. It's, that's 10. Let me get out of the way. Just take your time. The net's right there. Woo! Where's the good net? We'll just oh, there we go. Thank you. Yeah. All right, I'll take care of it once you get them out. Okay. On the teaser. On the teaser. Yeah, and the drift direction is changing. So uh, obviously, when we caught those first couple of fish, when we had like four fish on one drift. You know, we've got marks there, and uh, so we're trying to get back over those marks, but you go back up to where you uh, started on that particular line, and then you're moving an entirely different way. So, uh, but yeah, we're going to fix it now with the motor, with the trolling motor. Okay, so the trolling motor's down. Hopefully you can see my line, and yeah, it looks great. It's just a slight bit of scope with a three-ounce bucktail, and that's how you know you've got the trolling motor going in the right direction, because that's key. You want to run the boat in the direction that that current is moving. And if you do that, this is what you get, and it's working perfectly. Jack, uh, Rick, you're doing a good job with this. This is oh, a good... So you just say that. No, no, you are. I mean, it's uh, three ounces is like right here, right there. And we've been doing 0.5, so we're covering ground. We're not at point two. We're uh, kind of in virgin area again. I want to get to the slutty area. <laughs> I'm coming up. No oh, good. Luke sluts. And Cliff has. I think so? I see the, no, no, no. those shakes look like, that's fluke. Is it any size or? Nah. Nah. Yeah, I'm gonna have a weight to it. Weird, it's been chasing me for like two months, it feels like. Do you need a net? I might, I don't know, it's, you know, it's got a little weight to it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm thinking it might need a net. Yeah. Um, you, I'm, I don't, I'm, don't, I'm afraid to put this in the... Okay, just be ready to... Uh, I'm trying not to tangle. Give me the, hand me the net. Thank you. Bring them over. Good yep. fish. Go. Bring them, bring them. Walk them, walk them, walk them. Come on. Nice, nice fish. fish. Way to go, Rick, with the trolling motor. Whoa. And I avoided the tangle. Good. Nice. Oh, baby! Whoop, whoop! All right, now the speed that we're aiming at doing this is generally like 0 0.5 to one mile an hour, and you're probably you know, gonna be in this like you know, 0 0.6, 0 0.7, but we're doing this in contrast to if we just don't do anything, there is no drift. I mean, literally we're seeing 0 0.0, 0 0.2. So even if we can go a half a mile an hour, 
that is is way better and we're going <clears> to <throat> dial that speed in based on how much scope uh, is in the line how much of an angle and uh and here we go uh cliff is on again and uh you know with the trolling motor way huh oh oh boy all right i'm gonna get the big net yeah i'm gonna go get the big net Yeah, now that's a good fish. Pool fish coming up. And I, I would assume I have time since you were fishing uh, around block somewhere. Well, I don't have my time. Alright. Uh, Let's hope it's not snagged. Probably a snake. Little no, 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 it's good. It's all good. It's not, it's not a snake fish. You know what? Kelvin always yeah, I know, puts no, the I, kibosh I know, I know what he tries to do. <laughs> Halkis does it to me. Yeah, this is a big one. Here comes the pool fish. I think it is. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. Ah, it's a little blue fish. Ah, it feels pretty good. We'll see. Rick, move your line. Yeah, Rick, move your line. I'm hoping they can knock him off. Whoa, whoa. Slow and steady wins the race. Legit hook, big fish. Oh big fish. boy! Swing oh, him around oh, now. Oh, oh, oh. Just keep him moving. Keep him go. moving. Keep him moving. Got him. Way to go, man. We got to put that one on the pole again. Way to go, Cliffy. What do you think? I think that's nine. What what rod did you get that I got on? This on a brand new John Skinner Dark Matter <laughs> rod. Came to me this morning as a gift. I'm so happy. You have no idea. You know, like, I, I think. You, I found my boots this morning in my truck. I got a brand new fish rod. I just caught like a, I don't know, an eight or nine. That's nine pounds, I'd say. It's over nine, yes. Woohoo! Oh, a good thing about fishing in tidal areas is that if you don't like uh, how the drift is going, well, wait a while, it's probably going to change. Hey, we got a nice drift now. 0 0.6, 0 0.7, no trolling motor, perfect. It's three ounces, uh, just ideal, and, and yet the fishing is going to respond accordingly. A little, looks like a little too lively though, doesn't it? I don't know. Yeah, it's bouncing around a lot. Yeah, it looks like a sea bass. Oh, oh good, very good. Oh, he's hooked funny, right? Yeah, but uh, that's good. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, good. So that would be, yeah. 17. Way to go. That'd be three more to go then. All right, Joe and I are there at the bottom with two and two. You only got two? You suck. <laughs> oh, come on. Two-handed, nice two-handed right. hook set. Rick set. Oh yeah, oh. this is good. Net. Good. Oh wait a minute, Joe's you... coming with the net. What about this guy? No, he's got a fish too. He's trying to put the, the handle on the reel that. I don't think I should drop this it. This one's again. keeper. All right, I, I'm gonna. I might net. need a net here. Got you. Yeah, he right there. Right there. And it's a, it's a mite. It's not going to be huge, but the way they've been, it's probably good. Oh yeah, I think so. Dump, dump, dump in and get that. Yeah, just, just flip them out and go up. All right, Joe's coming. Joe's getting a lot of extra. Right, Joe. He didn't probably think he was working so hard. Oh, that's awesome. There we go. Oh, nice one. Joe likes it. Way to go, Jack. Nice. What a run, huh? Uh, what, a, what do we need now? I think we might be down to one. I think we just landed three keepers and we're going to have to count. That deserves a mark. Okay, the bag limit is four per man, five guys. Our limit's 20 fish. We're at 19. One more to go. Length limit is 19 inches, and we've had about 10 that were less than that. Yeah, three ounces is where it can find, too. Rick, is that a fish? Come on, Ricky. That's a, all right, easy does it, Rick. That's a really good one. We're going to, we're finishing this trip off in style. Okay, I'm getting the net. Easy does it, Rick. I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, let's not f*** him, yeah. He would have said to me, what do you like about it, guys? Sean? I just want to get this on video. Sure, I got you. No problem. That's a good one, dude. Oh, this yeah. is a really good one. Just yeah. Keep her bending. Keep her bending. Oh, keep them coming. 
number 20, the limit fish. That's right. A lot of pressure on you, Joe. You know, know. new guy on the boat. You, you're netting the big yeah, limit this gosh. year. I haven't Joe. missed one yet, guys. You're gonna go. <laughs> <No, he's good. laughs> it's, it's only like a 12-pound, you know, loop. I think it's this could be uh, this could be tennis. It's a big fish. Oh. I don't know if I can. Uh, I'm just yeah, trying to reel this one. Yeah, you can. You got it. Skinner rod oh will keep him on. There we go. Here's the doormat for him. Gonna swim him right in. Got him. Way to go, ah. Rick. Okay, here we go. Sick! Come right, Rick! Come right, Ricky! You do catch a fish every now and then, oh, Ricky. Right, cool. Good job, Ricky. Okay. <laughs> You're the man. You win the 20th fish. Whoa. Nice one, too. That's like, that's neat. And there's going to be a new kind of fishing on the way home running back. Um, yeah, everybody's sick of seeing balloons floating around, so uh, they see how many they can collect. So here we go. Oh, look at this. Oh, my. So this has been a new sport for these guys. Yeah. They have Woo, been. Hell yeah, yeah. Look, congratulations. <laughs> they are, congratulations. They're very excited. Woo, this is um, something they've been doing on the way in on their trips is they've been yeah, balloon baby, hunting look. just to get the crap out of the water. Cliff is extremely oh, excited here. Graduation. How many balloons did you get there? Uh, this is a good catch. This is, uh, looks like five. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. And this, six. oh, this was a this well, was, so that was a that's six. As good. So that's six a, keepers. that's six. Yep, six keepers. They're, they're all good. They're all good. Graduation. And, and, and like there's no limit. There's no limit. All right. There's no limit. Beautiful. Yep. Now yeah. Okay, a little less junk in the water. All right, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you're not already a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. And check out my online courses at saltstrong.com Skinner.